Pregnant Pitbull refuses to give birth. Then something unexpected happens. But before we start, please make sure to subscribe to MNR TV and hit the bell so you never miss any upload from us. Also, leave a like right now. It's always a good idea to visit a local animal shelter or rescue center if you're thinking of getting a pet. There are countless dogs, cats, and other animals waiting in these places, alone and afraid, hoping for a friendly new owner to walk in and give them a forever home. Marisa and Chris stepped into the shelter as they'd done many times in the past and took a look around. They vowed not to let themselves get too attached to the dogs they saw and promised themselves they'd only adopt one dog, even if they fell in love with several. It was clearly going to be a tough day and a huge decision when they found the dog that felt right for them. After looking around for a little while, Marisa saw a dog she knew was just right for her and Chris. It was a female dog and she immediately started wagging her tail and licking the couple's hands as they approached. They also noticed something special about this dog in particular. She was pregnant. She wasn't just a little pregnant either. She was very heavily pregnant. Her belly was all swollen up and filled with puppies. This would be a huge responsibility for Chris and Marisa, but when they looked into the pup's eyes and saw how much she needed a home, they just couldn't resist. But then something happened that made them wonder if they'd made the right call. So how had that pregnant dog ended up at the shelter in the first place? Well, Marisa and Chris asked the shelter workers for more information and were heartbroken when they learned the full story of the poor pup. Her name was Story and she'd been used as a backyard breeder by a cruel owner who forced her to get pregnant many times and sold her puppies. Eventually, it seemed like the owner just couldn't cope with all the puppies that Story was having and decided to surrender her to the shelter. Marisa and Chris felt so much love and care for Story, but then the vet told them something that simply shocked them. The vet revealed something that Marisa and Chris hadn't been expecting. Not only was Story very heavily pregnant, but she was actually long overdue. Plus, the vet had no explanation for why. She should have already given birth a long time ago, but it seemed like she was holding her babies inside, waiting and waiting for the right moment. Her belly was hugely swollen from all the little pups inside her and the situation was becoming dangerous. The vet worried that if Story didn't give birth soon, she might be in grave danger. It was clearly a very precarious situation. Now that Marisa and Chris knew the risks, what would they do? They had to act fast and make a decision very quickly. It was time for Marisa and Chris to make up their minds. They'd vowed to take only one dog home and technically Story was just one dog, but she was carrying around a bunch more of them inside her. Could Marisa and Chris really cope with all those puppies? Was it the right decision? They hesitated, unsure what to do and wanted to make the right call, both for themselves and for Story's well-being. While they were trying to decide and discussing the issues, Story walked up and put her head on Marisa's knee, looking up into her eyes lovingly. That was all Marisa needed to make her mind up. Marisa had made her mind up. As soon as she saw Story's little eyes looking up at her, she fell in love with a friendly, affectionate pit bull and knew that she and Chris had to help her. They agreed with the shelter workers to adopt Story and refused to leave her behind at the shelter. But how could they cope with all those puppies? Chris and Marisa already had 10 dogs at home. Adopting Story and all her puppies would double the size of their pack. As the couple discussed the issue, Chris had an idea. Why not foster the puppies and give them a loving home while the rescue workers try to find them families? So what was actually going on with Story? She'd been holding those puppies in her belly for so many months and still refused to give birth and bring them to the world. Marisa and Chris had a lot of experience with dogs, but they'd never seen anything like it before. They hoped that when Story got home, she'd settle down and give birth. However, they really started to worry about her holding off on having those puppies. They decided to research the issue online and see what they could find out. What they discovered shocked them to the core and made them terrified for Story's safety. As Marisa and Chris were researching the possible causes behind Story's refusal to give birth, they started to learn how trauma and stress can play a role in the problem. They discovered that if pregnant animals feel stressed or traumatized, they may not give birth until very late as their bodies are affected by the stress and they don't want to bring their puppies into a dangerous situation. Many dogs can feel trauma and stress just from being in shelters. Even though rescue centers and shelters are mostly nice places that do great work to save lots of animal lives, the dogs themselves don't understand all that. All they see are cages and bars. 
As Marisa and Chris continued their research into Story's pregnancy problem, their worries and fears only grew larger. They started to realize that their beloved dog was in a truly dangerous situation. Not only was her own health at risk from carrying around those babies longer than necessary, but the pups were also at risk of dying too. Chris and Marisa continued to learn more and began to see just how risky the situation really was. They knew they needed to take action as Story was simply refusing to have her babies. It was a life or death situation and the couple had to do something before it got any worse. Marisa and Chris made up their minds. They had to get Story to a vet as quickly as possible. There was just no other option available to them at the time. Their dog was in danger and her puppies might die if they didn't do something quickly. They called up their trusted vet and headed over with Story. The vet ran an ultrasound scan to find out what was going on inside the dog's tummy. She shook her head at the results and couldn't believe her eyes. She thought it had to be a mistake at first, but it wasn't. Then it was time for Chris and Marisa to hear the news. They could tell something strange was going on. They waited anxiously for their vet to reveal the results of the scan. When they saw her face and the look of shock she was wearing, they started to stress out. It felt like something was majorly wrong with Story, and they were desperate to hear the news but frightened of what it might be. The vet began to explain, showing them the results of the scan. She said that she discovered something completely unexpected inside Story's womb. She'd pointed out the shapes on the scan, showing Marisa and Chris the outlines. They quickly realized that there weren't six puppies inside Story after all. So what was really going on with their new dog? It turned out that Story didn't just have six puppies inside her. She had more, a lot more. She didn't just have seven, eight, nine, or even ten puppies growing in her belly. She had 18 of them. It's not uncommon for dogs to have large litters, but 18 is simply enormous and three times more than the couple was expecting based on what they'd been told by the rescue workers. The news came as a major shock as the vet showed Marisa and Chris the results of the scan and slowly pointed out all 18 of the pups inside their dog's womb. Taking on six puppies is already a massive thing, but 18? How would they cope with all that? How would they possibly be able to take care of all those new lives? Marisa and Chris were shocked by the news and couldn't believe what the vet had told them. 18 puppies all were waiting to come out into the world. They were completely overwhelmed by the very idea of it all and they were worried about Story too. Would she be okay giving birth to all those baby dogs? The vet felt that even though Story had been delaying the birth, it was about to arrive. She sent Marisa, Chris, and Story home and told them that she expected the puppies to arrive within the following day or two. She said that if Story didn't go into labor within 48 hours, they'd have to bring her back for more treatment. Marisa and Chris are lifelong animal lovers. For them, their dogs are a part of the family. Story was the newest member of the family and they cherished her dearly. Naturally, they were very worried about her well-being. They stressed and panicked all the way home, worrying and fretting about all the possible things that could go wrong. They loved their new dog and desperately wanted everything to work out okay, but it seemed like there were so many risks. Their dog was clearly in danger, plus she had 18 puppies that were all at risk as well. Both of the owners felt terrible for their pit bull and that's when Marisa came up with a smart idea. Marisa wanted to do something to ease her dog's discomfort and try to provide a safe and cozy space for Story to give birth. She decided to create a little haven in the family home. When they got back from seeing the vet, she immediately got to work. She started clearing out one of the bedrooms and then filling it with soft and comfortable things. She put blankets, pillows, and other cozy items in there to make it as welcoming, warm, and soft for Story as possible. She hoped that Story would at least be able to feel peaceful and safe in there. Once she was done, she and Chris let Story inside and left her there to sleep. Little did they know that a miracle was about to happen in their very own home. Marisa and Chris didn't sleep easy that night. They were both so stressed and worried about their poor dog, they kept thinking about what the vet had told them. They thought about how much pain and discomfort Story must be in with all those pups inside her. They fretted about how painful and dangerous the birth might be. When they finally decided to get up in the morning, the first thing they wanted to do was go and check on Story. They headed over to the bedroom and opened the door. They expected to see Story wagging her tail to greet them. Instead, they saw a new mom and her 18 gorgeous little pups. It turned out that Story had successfully given birth to every single baby during the night. It was only after seeing all those puppies that Chris and Marisa began to understand what had happened. It turned out that Story had been delaying the birth because she felt stressed out at the rescue shelter. She was hoping and waiting for a forever home, somewhere safe and warm, where she could peacefully give birth. It was almost like she knew all along that her happy home wasn't too far away. 
so she decided to hold off until she could have that safe space to bring her babies into the world. As soon as she got into that cozy, lovely bedroom Marisa made for her, Story felt protected and loved. Her stress levels dropped and her body did what it needed to do. It was a true miracle. During her time in the shelter, Story had just been biding her time. Meanwhile, all the workers, vets, and animal experts that visited had no idea what was going on. Nobody could understand why she hadn't given birth and nobody knew when they were finally going to see all those puppies. We often consider ourselves to be so much smarter than animals. However, this story shows that many animals have a bit of a sixth sense. They know things we don't. Story knew that she couldn't give birth until she felt like she was somewhere safe where her pups would be treated with care. That's why she waited all that time. And thanks to her new owner, she was finally able to welcome her 18 pups into the world. The first couple of weeks of the puppies' lives were simply wonderful. Chris and Marisa watched with glee as the puppies slowly started to grow, opening their eyes for the first time, moving around, drinking their mom's milk, and growing stronger every day. Before long, they were hopping and playing in the yard, all together as a happy family. Story had a lovely time playing with her pups, too. But the situation couldn't last forever. The couple had agreed to be foster parents for the pups, while the rescue center helped them find forever homes. And as it didn't take long for the adoption request to start flooding in, as soon as people saw photos of the puppies, they fell in love with them. The couple couldn't believe how quickly the adoption request began to stack up. People love puppies after all, and these pitbull pups were super cute and totally irresistible. By the time they reached the age of just 10 weeks, every single pup had been adopted by a happy family. They all found great homes and will hopefully live with their owners for the rest of their lives. Naturally, Chris and Marisa were a little bit sad to see their adorable puppies depart, but they knew it was for the best. But how about Story? Was she going to end up in a new home too? Well, the way her story turned out is surprising. Even though Chris and Marisa adored Story, they only agreed to foster her to give her a safe and happy home while she had the babies. They never really intended to keep her longer than that and they already had 10 pit bulls of their own to look after permanently. So the rescue workers also began sending out photos and details on Story. One man was just amazed at what the brave dog had gone through, keeping all those puppies inside her and then finally giving birth. He knew he had to meet Story and see if they had a connection in real life, and they did. They shared an instant bond, and the guy took Story home. He had her spayed too, ensuring that she'd never have to cope with another pregnancy. Even though Story couldn't possibly stay with all 18 of her pups for their whole lives, she proved to be a wonderful mother. It must have been so tiring for her to carry them around in her belly for so long. She'd gone through a lot and the birth had to be very difficult and painful too. However, even after going through all that, Story proved to be so loving and kind. Chris and Marisa watched as she nursed and cleaned every single one of her pups. Even when she was completely exhausted, she never stopped caring for them and did so until the day they left. She was a true angel. It's fair to say that Chris and Marisa, along with the rescue workers and the kind people who adopted the dogs after the birth, all helped to save 19 canine lives. All 18 of Story's pups are in their own new homes and doing great. Their owners love them, take them for walks, play with them each day, and give them lots of tasty treats as well. Story, meanwhile, is also in a happy home. If Chris and Marisa hadn't been willing to take a chance on her, who knows how this story might have turned out. Story's stress would likely have delayed the birth even more, potentially putting her life and the lives of the little ones at risk. Story's story is an inspiring one. We're so glad it had a happy ending. However, it's important to never forget that she's not the only dog who ended up in a shelter. There are literally millions of dogs and cats and other animals too without happy homes. They're all sitting in shelter cages right now, hoping to be taken home and given the love and care they deserve. Shelter workers do so much work and work tirelessly for their animals, but they need our support. Even if you can't donate or adopt a pet permanently, you can help. You can choose to become a foster parent for the dogs, just like Chris and Marisa did. This means you look after the dogs until they're ready to be adopted.